Hello and welcome to another tutorial for ePage Creator. My name is Raymond and today we'll be doing a tutorial on creating links. So as you can see I've already imported a sample PDF that I will be using for this tutorial and on the front cover I'm going to add a link to our actual ePage Creator homepage. So to do that first I'd go up here click on add link. Under link type there are multiple options you can choose from. I, for this one, I'm going to be using web link. For target, I'm going to set it as blank because I want it to open in a separate window. If I choose cell, it's just going to open in the same window and I don't want that. So for the link, I'm going to change it to http epagecreator.net. And under more settings, I can change what the links looks like if I want it to be visible or invisible and what color it turns into when someone actually hovers over it and under the text I can change the rollover text so I can do ePage right, ePage creator home page and click OK then you'll get a rectangular box like this and you just resize it like so and that's it very simple to view these links click on preview and you'll notice that the outline is no longer there so normally you would make it a distinct color so people would actually know there's a link there but sometimes people don't want to so when someone hovers over it they'll see <clears throat> ePage Creator homepage they click on it opens up to the ePage Creator homepage so besides this link I've also created another link if I go to the next page it's the table of contents Although the page numbers don't actually match up with the number of pages in this book, I created a bookmark over beautiful bookmarks. If I click on it, it jumps to the actual section in the book where I have create that talks about bookmarks. So that's one of the link types that you can create, the go to link type. So it pretty much uh, creates a link that when someone clicks will open to a certain page within the publication. And the back cover where we have all this contact info I've created another link that says go to contact it's another web link that when you click on it would open to the contact page for our software so yeah these are just three examples of links I can create using ePage Creator thank you for watching